Have you ever used a refrigerator, ridden in a car, listened to music, watched television, or used a computer? Did you know that all of these things need magnets to work properly? Magnets are all around us, but what exactly are magnets? To answer that question, we'll have to go small, very, very small. All things are made of particles called atoms. Atoms are the building blocks of everything, but they're so small you cannot even see them. If you could see the atoms in a magnet, you would notice that they're all neatly aligned and facing the same direction, like in the top diagram. If something is not magnetic, the atoms are all jumbled every which way. When the atoms align in this way, it creates a magnetic field with a north pole and a south pole. When an object is magnetized, it attracts ferromagnetic metals like iron, nickel, and cobalt inside its magnetic field. Magnets can attract or repel other magnets. When two magnets are attracted, they pull towards each other. Opposite poles attract, so if the north pole of one magnet is facing the south pole of another, they will attract and stick together. Magnets can also repel or push away from one another. Place the north pole of one magnet next to the north pole of another and watch as they push each other away as if by magic. Did you know the Earth is a giant magnet? Its iron core creates a magnetic field with a north pole and a south pole. That is why a compass always points north. Its magnetized needle is attracted to the Earth's north pole. It's official. We would be lost without magnets. This video was created by La Fontaine of Knowledge. For lesson materials that go along with the video, be sure to check the link in the video description. And subscribe to my channel for more videos like this.